Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this uh, green uh, and uh, blue triangles uh, put together. As you can see in this uh, diagram, such that the area of this uh, blue triangle is uh, 8 uh, centimeter square. The angle uh, BDC is uh, 45 degrees. And this uh, angle uh, ACD is uh, 15 degrees. And moreover, this angle uh, ABC is uh, 90 degrees. And now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this uh, green shaded triangle. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. And in this video, I am going to share with you with two different uh, approaches. So therefore, please watch the video till the very end. Before we proceed any further, let me go over the basic uh, review. Let's recall the exterior angle theorem. According to this theorem, the exterior angle of a triangle is equal to the sum of two opposite uh, interior angles, as you can see in this uh, diagram. Here we got uh, this, uh, our exterior angle uh, C, whereas uh, A and uh, B are uh, our opposite uh, interior angles, such that uh, C equals to A plus B. And here's an example. So this angle uh, is going to be our exterior angle and that is going to be equal to the sum of these uh, two opposite uh, interior angles. So therefore, uh, this angle is going to be 50 plus 60 is going to make uh, 110 uh, degrees. And now let's recall the 30, 60, 90 degrees uh, special uh, triangle as you can see over here. And here we can see that 30 degrees is our smallest angle. So the side uh, opposite to that angle is going to be our smallest uh, leg. Whereas uh, this uh, 90 degree angle uh, is our largest angle. So the side uh, opposite to that one is going to be our longest uh, leg. So in such kind of uh, 30, 60, 90 triangle, uh, the longest uh, leg is always uh, twice the smallest uh, leg. If the smallest leg is uh, one, then the longest leg is going to be two units. So in general, if uh, the smallest leg is uh, A units, uh, then the longest leg is going to be two times A units and the third uh, leg is going to be A times uh, square root of uh, three. Let's assume that this uh, smallest leg is uh, five units, uh, then the longest leg is going to be 10 uh, units and this third leg is going to be five uh, times uh, square root of uh, three. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this uh, blue triangle uh, BDC. We know that this uh, angle is uh, 45 degrees. This angle is uh, 90 degrees. So therefore, this angle has got to be 45 degrees uh, as well. So therefore, we conclude that this is an isosceles uh, triangle. So therefore, uh, this uh, side length is going to be equal to this uh, side length. Let's assume that uh, this uh, side length uh, is uh, A, then uh, this side length uh, has got to be A as well. And now let's recall the area of a triangle formula. Area equals to a half times base uh, times height. In our case, uh, our base is uh, A and our height is uh, A as well, whereas the area of this uh, blue triangle is uh, 8. So let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, formula. Our area is 8 equal to a half uh, times a times a. So therefore, we got 8 equal to a square divided by 2. Let's multiply both sides by 2 to isolate a square. So we can see this 2 and 2 is gone. So therefore, a square turns out to be 16. Let's undo this square by taking a square root on both sides. So therefore, our a value turns out to be positive 4. So therefore, our this side length turns out to be positive 4 and this side length is positive 4 as well. And now let's recall the exterior angle theorem once again. The exterior angle of a triangle is equal to the sum of uh, two opposite uh, interior angles as you can see in this uh, diagram. And here we can see that this is uh, our exterior angle 45 degrees whereas uh, this uh, 15 degrees uh, and this angle uh, are opposite uh, interior angles. So if this angle is 15 degrees, uh, this angle has got to be 30 degrees. So therefore our this angle uh, DAC turns out to be 30 degrees. And we know that this angle is uh, 90 degrees and this uh, angle is going to be 
15 degrees plus 45 degrees is going to make uh, 60 degrees and here we can see that this uh, triangle ABC is a 30 60 90 special uh, triangle as you can see over here our this uh, BC length uh, is uh, 4 uh, units and we know that this is our smallest leg uh, and this is our uh, longest uh, leg so therefore in such kind of a special triangle longest leg is uh, twice the smallest leg if the smallest leg is uh, 4 then the longest leg is going to be 8 and this uh, third leg has got to be 4 times uh, square root of uh, 3 so therefore our this uh, a b side length uh, is going to be 4 times uh, square root of uh, 3 and this our a c side length is going to be 8 and now let's make an observation we can see that this uh, b d length uh, is uh, 4 and this uh, a b length is uh, 4 times uh, square root of 3 so therefore uh, this uh, AD segment uh, is going to be this uh, minus uh, this so we can write uh, 4 times uh, square root of 3 minus uh, 4 and now let's go ahead and calculate the area of this uh, green triangle uh, ADC and now let's recall once again the area of a triangle uh, formula area equals to a half times uh, base times height and in our case uh, the base of this uh, green triangle is uh, 4 times square root of 3 minus 4 and the height uh, is uh, 4 so therefore the area of this uh, green triangle is going to be a half times uh, I'm going to write down uh, 4 times uh, this uh, 4 times uh, square root of uh, 3 minus uh, 4 and here 1 over 2 times 4 is going to give us uh, 2 so therefore uh, this could be written as uh, 2 times uh, 4 times the uh, square root of uh, 3 minus uh, 4 let's go ahead and distribute uh, 2 so that is going to give us uh, 8 times uh, square root of 3 minus uh, 8 so therefore the area of this uh, green triangle turns out to be 8 times uh, square root of 3 minus 8 uh, centimeter square and now let me show you the alternative approach and now let's make an observation we can see the area of this uh, green uh, triangle is going to be equal to the area of this uh, big uh, triangle uh, ABC minus uh, the blue triangle area which is uh, 8 so therefore now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this big triangle uh, ABC so let's go ahead and calculate the area of this uh, triangle uh, ABC and once again let's recall the area of a triangle formula area equals to a half times a base times height and here we can see the base of this triangle ABC is a 4 times square root of 3 and the height uh, is a 4 so therefore the area of this triangle ABC is going to be a half uh, times a 4 times this uh, 4 times a square root of uh, 3 and if we simplify everything uh, that is going to give us uh, 8 times uh, square root of uh, 3 so therefore triangle ABC area turns out to be 8 times uh, square root of 3 and here's our final step let's go ahead and calculate uh, the area of this uh, green triangle we figured out uh, this uh, triangle ABC area which is uh, 8 times uh, square root of 3 and we know already the blue triangle area is uh, 8 so let's go ahead and fill in the blanks so the area of this uh, green triangle is going to be 8 times uh, square root of 3 minus uh, 8 so thus the green triangle area turns out to be 8 times square root of 3 minus 8 uh, centimeter square and that is equal to 5.86 uh, centimeter square thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye